Good morning. Welcome to Breakfast with Charlie State and Naga Monchetti. Our headlines today. The race to be the next leader of the Conservative Party heats up as former Chancellor Rishi Sunak joins the list of contenders. The body of Japan's former Prime Minister Shinzo Abe arrives in the capital Tokyo a day after he was assassinated at a political rally. Elon Musk pulls out of a £36 billion deal to buy Twitter. Good morning from Centre Court Wimbledon on Women's Final Day, when there will be a new name on the trophy. But the journey here is over for British number one, Cameron Ori in the men's draw. He was beaten in his semi-final in four sets by the defending champion, Novak Djokovic. Good morning. The temperatures are going to be the talking point of the weather forecast this weekend. Things really warming up again, particularly by Sunday. Lots of strong sunshine and things remaining mostly dry. I'll have all the details here on BBC Breakfast. Good morning. You can see Western Supermare Pier behind me. At the moment, the beach is still relatively quiet, bar the odd dog walker. But many will be packing picnics now, heading down here, making the most of this glorious weather. Good morning. It's Saturday the 9th of July. The race to replace Boris Johnson as leader of the Conservative Party is gathering pace this morning. Four MPs have launched their campaigns to become the next Prime Minister. They include former Chancellor Rishi Sunak, whose resignation earlier this week helped trigger the mass walkout of ministers that forced Mr Johnson to stand down. And this weekend, more candidates are expected to announce their intention to run, as our political correspondent Ioni Wells reports. Will you be standing for the leader?